I am about to watch, because I haven't yet, and we want to talk about it on the show, and I figure, I don't know, maybe we'll put this on YouTube. I'm going to watch the infamous uh, Ricochet versus Will Ospreay match. Uh, I'll probably have a little bit of audio in the background, so you'll kind of know where I'm at with stuff. Um, but uh, I don't know, it's all going to be in Japanese, isn't it? <laughs> well, I mean, I think it's also, like, there's there's noise other than the commentators, I think. Right, 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 right. So I, I'm going to listen to it. We're going to watch it. I want to try to fit it in here, because we got another interview lined up here uh, for, for uh, podcast day. Uh, so, so, so I want to get right into it. I actually skipped ahead to what I think is the beginning of the match. So I'm at 2:54 just to hit play. So if you want to sync up with me at that, and point. for those that don't know, this is part of the best of the Super Juniors tournament this year. It's a round robin tournament that they do to crown that, to crown the best of the Super Juniors. By the way, okay, so Ricochet just gestured to uh, a fan in the audience, and ring the bell just rang. So sync to that. Um, <laughs> can you hear that on the microphone? Uh, I can a little bit, yeah. A little bit. I can turn up my stuff a little bit. That's just crowd noise and whatever. But, um, yeah, he just gestured to a fan uh, right before the bell uh, in a PWG shirt in Japan. Uh, so I, <laughs> I really appreciate that. That Man, this Ricochet guy, he's got a very familiar tattoo. Just saying. <laughs> just saying. All right, so they're locking up. We're, we're getting into it. I don't know. I, 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 my impression from the comments I have seen, I've been avoiding because I want to watch the match before I read the comments, uh-huh. is a lot of flippy stuff for 20 minutes, right? Which a little under 20 minutes. I get to, yeah. Matches only like maybe 15 or 16. I mean, that's the that's the, that's the, well, yeah, the 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 video is 20, 22, 23 minutes. So, wow, wow. I want to point out. Okay, that was a pretty good chain right there. <laughs> We're in the peck flexing phase of Ricochet's match. Uh, so. We're gesturing at each other. So. Um, and I don't think I've witnessed much Will Ospreay. And you talked about, Eamon, that you you saw Will Ospreay uh, WrestleMania weekend. So I, I saw this match WrestleMania weekend as well. So Really? You saw these two? Yes. Did it, did it reflect this match? Uh, the match at Evolve is very, very good. Yeah, uh, I do. I do feel they topped it. Wow. Okay. Okay. So this is, this is kind of a a a a redo of that match. Wow. <laughs> All right. Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. Wow. I believe you got to that big sequence that everyone's been sharing. Yeah, I just got to the the synchronized backflips and superhero pose. Holy yes. shit! Now listen, I I, I got to see uh, show redacted uh, a couple of weeks ago uh, down there in uh, Boyle Heights, Los Angeles, and there was some stuff that I witnessed. Like I've witnessed good wrestling. I whether it be with IWC, RWA, uh, uh, Ring of Honor in town, or anything like that. I witnessed some some great, athletic, impressive, effing wrestling. I don't know if I want to swear on this one. Um, the well, that's a spoiler thing. There's some swearing coming up. Okay. Well, but, okay. Oh, jeez. <laughs> well, you know, Japan. Uh, so, but that is like, and and I think we'll get into the discussion of of this match and everybody's response, of course, on uh, Indie Mayhem Show uh, 122. If you want to look that up on YouTube, uh, iTunes, wherever, uh, or podcasts or whatever. Um, I'm in the mode of you have to appreciate the athleticism. And, yeah. and and again, like you know, Ring, Ring of Honor when I was like, that's not real wrestling. It's it's weird sequences and nobody sells, right? Yeah, but they're doing some sick shit in there, right? Yeah, yeah. And they're also like not straight punching each other in the face, you know, which I think that is appreciated too. That is impressive when I see the 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 crazy strong style matches on on New Japan, but this is something different. Yeah, we're at another slow point here. As if I'm just sitting back one you kind of like soak this in and get the full experience. What's that? Just want just seeing you get the full experience. I think is is interesting. Yeah, to we'll me. slow it down. We're getting some he's kicking them. We're not doing crazy stuff. That's pretty crazy. This <laughs> is the I, I, it's it's a stretch move. It's an abdominal stretch with a with a where he's wrapped his legs around his yes head and and leg. Uh, that's impressive. That's different. 
it, and and so so presumably the people that have commented on this have watched this match, right? Presumably. So uh, now that uh, we will get into more in the discussion, but some are thinking that uh, from what Vader has been implying that he only saw it based off of gifts people have been sharing. He hasn't seen the full match. It's true, true. You know, Vader don't got time for that. So <laughs> he's too busy mastodoning somewhere. Um, no, Vader's awesome. Vader's awesome. He's, he's been like with Vader. us. I he's, yeah, I like Vader. He's been with us with IWC and everything. Um, but, I mean, you know, people are going to have opinions on this. I mean, uh, there's a lot of people that I talk to that say Chikara is 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 hack, kayfabe, kayfabe cool, killing bullshit, right? And, right. wow. <laughs> that, that, take that, fan. Um, it was the one step on the middle rope flip by Ricochet. Yes. Um, yeah, that's pretty cool. Oh, they were chanting Ricochet. Okay, it's just with an <laughs> accent. I got it. <laughs> Are they announcing time limits on this? Is this like an uh, indie show? Yeah, usually when the announcer chimes in, usually that's like a five minute, like whatever happens has been five minutes sort of thing. Um, well, I guess I the, that, the referee doesn't have a thing in his ear, so it is like an indie show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a, they have a 30 minute time limit for this match, I believe. So. Okay. Ooh. Some stiff kicks. So I definitely, yeah, because I think it's important to also see, like, there, there's a mix of stuff in this. It's not, yeah, I mean, obviously, this, this is a slower part. It, 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 obviously, they're flippy, but that's their style, you know. They're doing submission moves, and, and literally, like, submission moves, I don't think I've seen. This is the uh, Ricochet has Osprey around his back. Um. Now he's just kind of. I'm trying to. Uh, Osprey is upside down. <laughs> it's like Brock Lesnar's old move, but Sprock had that kind of torture rack stretch thing, right? Didn't he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's like that, but more upside downy. You talking about the one like where his legs like wrapped around his neck? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we're just, you know, doing punches, forearms mostly. Forearms. More. Whoa. Catch in midair <laughs> and knee drop. That's good. That's good. I mean, this is. It's paced. There are fast yeah. sequences, but this is paced. I mean, this is this is how I like my wrestling these days, you know? Um, you know, it's not the WWE style or anything, but it's also, you know, it's also where it is. Like, you wouldn't see this match per se in Lucha Underground, even, I think. I, I, I think if you did, you would see it very rarely. Right, right, right. Like, this would be like a, a an as or a, a Ultima Lucha uh, a level match, right? That they get into. And keep this. in mind, this is a part of a round robin tournament where they're wrestling. For, there's two blocks of eight wrestlers, so they have to wrestle everyone in their block. Okay. And and eventually get to a final is between this, the two from each block. Is this an over several nights kind of thing? Yes. This happened. This ha it lasts like thirteen days. Like yeah. it's like span out, obviously, but like it's about like a thirteen day kind of tournament. Ooh. And this is like I think they're like third match. The uh, throw into the ropes, uh, uh, handspring off of the ropes uh, into. <laughs> I think he kicked them in the, fa in the face. I don't know. Kind of like it's kind of a blur. Kick. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like. Uh, to get That's one of my favorite moves he does, yeah, personally. Um, it, and, 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 yeah, a little bit of like, um, he, he's doing like flips and stuff and as desperation moves, right? Like, where's the energy from? Yeah. But I think you can chalk everything up to adrenaline if you're trying to sell it. Oh, cheerio, motherfucker. Got to that point. <laughs> yeah. I gotta tell you, this is telling me on Will Osprey. I think I will be paying more attention. Yes, indeed. Osprey was on the TNA tour in the UK, mm. uh, and, and I was very upset of how very sparsely they used him. Which, oh, that's part for the course. Um, it is, <laughs> and he just kissed the camera. That's great. Um, do is is Osprey in any sort of running for this cruiserweight tournament with uh, WWE? Uh, many many would argue he's from the UK. He's he wrestles around the same parts as like a Zack Sabre Ooh. Jr. Um, so definitely could be in the running. I would think. 
He, did, um, he just jumped in for the QAS uh, destroyer type move. Which wait, where did we just see that in WWE? Who just did that? Was that that four-way match they did that? Oh yeah, yeah. Sami Zayn and Cesaro. Zayn and Cesaro, yeah. Whoop. Wow. 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 <laughs> Yeah, yeah. It, it, again, the flippy stuff they do is insane. Yes. Yeah. Absolutely. But again, oh. Flips from the turnbuckle. <laughs> oh. I get such a Mortal Kombat, um, I get I such get my Mortal Kombat pop every time there's like a leg sweep. Uh huh. Like there's a real me. Mortal Kombat moment moment towards the end. I think. Oh, is there? Is there yeah. a fatality? Is that what you're building me up to? That's a little bit of a spoiler, Eamon. I think I think you may know when you see it. <laughs> oh, how close am I? Is there a lot of after on this? No, uh, there shouldn't be. Maybe if there, I don't know about the this version of it, but there may be like a little. Okay. Moment. I'm at the 14 plus minute mark. And then you also just heard this is awesome chance, which like I said before, is very rare for a Japanese crowd. Somebody's been watching NXT. <laughs> they're on the apron. They're kicking each other. And that was a Death Valley dropper onto, onto the apron, which gets no sold into a sweep around and some kind of crazy reverse hurricanrana. I don't know. I'm not the guy that calls wrestling and knows moves. That's you, Eamon. No, you got it pretty much right. Eamon, I need you to call this match for me so I can <laughs> understand a little more what's going on. That's what needs to happen. That's the holy shit chant, I think. Yes. 20 count? Yeah, uh, 20 count on the floor. Okay. It's a quick count, so no wonder it's 20. <laughs> and they, they, New Japan makes it, you know, they keep it real. <laughs> yes, they do. Hence, strong style. <laughs> oh, go. That guy's going to help you up. That guy's going to help you up, Will. Do it. Everybody. Everybody makes it. It's getting their teeth. Is, that, is there blood on Osprey's back? Uh, I don't remember. Possibly. Uh, I respect. Uh, so Ricochet, like at some point, reaches straight towards the camera. <laughs> good, pr good presence. Good presence. I'm sorry. I just love when any wrestler, you know, especially guys like this that can be accused of be like flippy and stuff, like actually do play towards the camera. Mm -hmm. I don't see enough of it on the indies. I definitely think you can tell. Like these guys are a level of like charismatic, you know. Oh yeah. I'm glad nobody would be crazy enough to put one of them under a mask. <laughs> this is good. This is good. Oof. You know, you know what my problem at this point is? Whoa. Is that a headbutt? Yep, that was a headbutt. Okay. Um, like, at this point of the match, I'm sad that they don't have hair, so they look like they're in, like, worse shape than they are. <laughs> like, and I'm, I'm going back to the, the Iron Woman match between Sasha and Bailey. Because at this right. point of the match, they looked like hell. <laughs> All right, I'm guessing Will is signaling a finisher of some sort. We got a fisherman into a rollover to another. Oh, God. To the fanciest stunner I've ever seen. 
to pick <laughs> her face. Wow, that I saw the gif. That I saw the gif. <laughs> that, I don't care who you are. I think Vader's just mad he can't do that ever <laughs> in his life. Could you imagine Vader if Vader did that? Like, Vader was a crazy athletic big guy. No, you're talking about that, like, big spinning kick he does, right? No, 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 no. I'm talking about when they both, like, float over together. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, the, the synchronized ballet shit they did in the air. Yeah. I think I saw that at Show Redacted, too. Now I think about it. <laughs> or something. I don't know. I know it wasn't the show with 16 people. It all blends together, but definitely not that part. Wow. Float over. Oof. Oof. False finishes out the Yang. <laughs> well, I'm going to be slight distracted because I'm going to have to set up. This, is, this has to be almost over, right? Uh, it, it, yeah, it's just about over. If I'm Ooh. Um. I don't even know how many revolutions that was for uh, Mr. Ricochet. <laughs> to jump into an empty pool. Wow! <laughs> you ever just see a move and not entirely understand the physics of it? Which movie are you talking about? Um, it was kind of a reverse DDT thing, and I can't explain anything else that happened. It could be because oh. I'm getting tired. It could be because the move was that awesome. <laughs> I, I, you know, I, I'm not sure what is what at this point. I need to drink more caffeine. I know that to keep up with this. <laughs> so, yeah, again, the pacing is not bad. Face slaps, face slaps, kicks, lots of kicks, something flippy. Oh, caught in midair. What is this? Oh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. What are these two for do what are these to do with other people? Jeez, that was the match. <laughs> that was it. That's the match everybody's been talking about and my reactions to it. I hope that was entertaining. <laughs> So, if you, want to go, if you want to listen to our further discussion, Indie Mayhem Show episode 122. There you we'll go. There you go. Let's see what happens there.